What if your students were so eagerly engaged in a lesson, they wished it wouldn't end? With Amplify Desmos Math, we believe in math that motivates. That makes sense. Math is unique because everyone's coming in with their own thoughts and feelings. Some students are incredibly confident. Get the score of 400. Some students are a little bit more timid, but once you can unlock a child's thinking around their, maybe their fear around math, it opens up an entire new world for them. It sounds like very loud because everybody's talking with each other and helping each other, and it's really good. Seeing those aha moments, seeing kids share their strategies with each other and then coming back and then not being afraid to share out. I like sharing my ideas in math class because sometimes they come up with like really good ideas that I really want to share. And what that does for the students is puts the students at the center of the learning. So notice something you see or a wonder, something you're thinking about. So it just gives them a lot of freedom and ownership of, of their learning and I think they like that. Oh, this might help us. In this problem-based curriculum, it absolutely gets messy and it gets loud and we have kids using manipulatives and they're up and they're thinking and they're talking. A structured approach to problem-based learning gets results by developing deep conceptual understanding and procedural fluency through real-world application. Step-by-step -step instructional moves systematically build from students' prior knowledge, supporting teachers as they guide students to grade-level outcomes makes it a little bit easier for teachers to say, okay, what is that next move that I need to make? What's that next question I can ask? Okay, Samantha found 21 or 28. What did you find? You can focus on parts of the lesson to then dive deep in, but the structure pieces, they've been doing those routines since day one, and so they know what the expectation is with those routines. In every math classroom, student thinking is valuable and can be made evident. Amplify Desmos Math provides instructional moves with a powerful digital platform, delivering real-time student thinking. Yes, there is pencil and paper, and there's so much more. The dashboard, you have the assessments, you have the data that's coming back. They can see firsthand on the data dashboard how their students are performing on the task. How did you organize your bar? It does a good job of making the students thinking visible so you can kind of see quickly, are my kids getting it or not? Or do I need to reteach anything or not? Like in the moment. Educators are empowered to differentiate when and how it matters most, to support, strengthen, and stretch all learners, ensuring all students can access grade-level math every day. The cool thing about Amplify Desmos Math is that it's equitable across the board. It allows every kid to have access to the same thing without singling anybody out or making them feel that they're not where they're supposed to be. It's fantastic because they're able to then participate and feel like they're a part of the classroom when they might not have been like that before. With Amplify Desmos Math, students never feel left behind, empowering them to take risks. So I feel like it's more of a safe space than in other classes too. If you do a mistake, you just fix it and that you will keep that in your brain so you know that we make mistakes and that you can um, do better next time. Everything is in one place with core instruction, integrated personalized learning, and embedded intervention teachers can trust. Amplify Desmos Math ensures that all students feel supported and challenged, building lifelong mathematical proficiency for all students. And in order to be successful in this world, you have to be able to critically think and solve problems. This whole approach kind of encompasses that whole thing, not just in academics, but in life. So for real, for real, every single day I come to school. My favorite subject in school is always math because I get better at math.